Hey everybody, thanks for wandering back out to the Digital Hermitage. I'm the Hermit, you can call me Hiccup, and this is my buddy Timely Crow. Thanks again for joining us for our Grounded playthrough. Grounded playthrough. Grounded. Last time we had just found the Battle Toad, and I don't know if you heard it, um, it played the little tune when we found it, but if you get really close to its chest, it's still playing the music. What? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's really uh, funny. That's awesome. Uh, I've also been standing here just absolutely murdering all these gnats. Guys, this is actually, like, for food, this little hut. Oh, yeah, let me show you the little hut we got going on. Uh, it's not finished yet. We got to go find some stem and some sap, which is what we're going to do today, although that's a side plot. Um, I'm sure Timely keep, wants to keep exploring in, in one direction or another around here, so we'll just gather as we go. That's not, you know, building this was not the main the main concept of the episode we're just we're just building this to survive but uh dude come check this out i was collecting so many of these gnats earlier just because there's so many of them around there and it looks like it will let me place a couple here even though these these pieces aren't finished oh no it won't oh that's a darn shame um, oh yeah yeah i have so many gnat pieces i really wanted to just maybe i can hang them in the window or something i really just wanted to put a few of them up because like these are some of my favorite trophies, just because of the way that they hang. Like, I love this. That's so funny. Yeah, I can see him, like, it's for there. <laughs> oh, it won't let me build it still. Really? The windows are finished. Come on. Okay, fine. I guess we just have some extra gnat fuzz and meat for battles today. Um, <laughs> when this house is finished, <laughs> I'm putting gnat trophies everywhere. Uh, nat, nat, nat. Seriously, though. Oh my gosh, my inventory's full. I have so much. Uh... Dude, here, come and come and steal some meals for the day. Steal some meals. Oh yeah, and I've got four more gnat meat on me. Uh, yeah, guys, let me cook all this food real quick so that me and Timely have plenty to eat and uh, plenty to heal us while we're exploring, and then I'll bring you back when we've picked a direction and we'll we'll just keep looking around the yard. Yeah, I just noticed outside topped over here uh oh first um so out there uh you you just mentioned um there's a jack-o-lantern i don't uh, know, like is that is that new is that you know like is that like a halloween thing that they did for an update or i want to say it is because i don't remember seeing it in my previous playthroughs even though it's it's been a while since my previous playthroughs but like that just feels so appropriate to the time right now i want to say it was probably part of the last update but I don't know, guys. You you can you can you can make fun of me in the comments if you want, but like when updates happen, I just let it update and I just never look at the patch notes. I want to explore and find it in game, you know. <laughs> yeah, yeah, for sure. That's I, uh, yeah, I I definitely love that for sure. Yeah. Um, speaking of uh, yeah, there um, I've been playing a lot of Terraria off to the side. Um, I saw that it got some huge update and i was like well let me just check it out and it is it's fun to come back to a game that you're like oh i've already put 100 you know hundreds of hours into this and you're like i don't know what's going on anymore <laughs> like everything's different that's true yeah i know uh yeah. conan just recently did that for me and my wife ember we, we played through conan a lot over the years and uh they just re reworked it so that the player feels a lot more capable and you don't have to have like a normally you'd like enthrall uh, a person and, and use them as like your bodyguard and, and I feel like that's what the combat was mostly focused around in the in the other game in the older version of the game but like now the player feels much more capable of fighting things rather than just like uh hey Mr. Thrall will you go beat that up for me you know <laughs> right yeah. dude look at all this aphid honeydew well, I was gonna say man there's a lot of it I've been I've been picking it up that's crazy. That's like, for me, finding that somewhere out in the world is like, good luck. So, like, I've got 10 on me right now. We're set. All right. Yeah, this this is a fun little island. Yeah. Sure. This uh, is nice. Food, avid meat. Um, you know, there's, there is, uh, you know, potentially mosquitoes, but. <laughs> right. Let me show you guys where we are on the map just to. Oh, literally the one island in the middle of the pond down here. Yeah. No, this island is great. I feel like the only thing we're missing out here is what um, stem. We had a kind of limited supply of stem, and then uh, sap is something else we're gonna have to pick up a lot of today. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Let me make sure my inventory is pretty clean. Oh yeah, I've got a lot of food and aphid honeydew, but that's disposable as we go. All right, yeah, pick a direction, my dude. Where are we going? Yeah. yeah. Um. Doo -doo. Let me see. Give me one sec. I got to, uh, I want to run back to the other, the other base. I, uh, 
You know the hot deposit, like where you deposit everything? Yeah. I deposited like all my arrows. Um, oh snap, all right. Just all, <laughs> all gone. <laughs> all right, yeah, well, let's make a quick adventure over there. Uh, probably be good to grab some sap while we're there anyway, just so we could throw up some, oh, that's some a good stuff. Point. Yeah. Uh -huh. All right, well, yeah, let us run back to the base, guys. I'm going to keep filming just in case anything funny happens. But uh, if not, we'll see you back at this base when we start the journey. Always good to run home to your main base, though, to restock for sure. Ah, water fleas. Now, yeah, bad. weird things are so weird. Probably not a bad idea anyway. Uh, could fix my, my red ant club. That thing is taking a beat, and we did a lot of ant fighting last time. Ant fighting. Ants and larva. Whoa. Trowel. Go away, mites. Mr. Battletoad. Man, Mr. Battletoad has given me serious, uh... My buddy Loss has been getting into comic books lately, and, uh... Comic books are pretty cool. I've never gotten super deep into them. There's a few that I like here and there, but, uh... He's been reading T Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles comics lately, and, uh... He's been reading this one that takes place way in the future, and there's only one turtle left, and the main bad guy is like Shredder's like great grandkid, and apparent and apparently the uh, like the one turtle that's left, the mutation that made them into what they are, you know, it kept affecting him. So he's he's giant now, and he's super powerful, super fast, and he can use all four weapons. And apparently, it's quite a tearjerker because you do go back and like learn like which turtles we lost and who the remaining one is. And I'm not gonna say anything and spoil anything, but. Guys, that, that just, like, I'm sitting here looking at him like, this is a TMNT comic? And he's like, oh, yeah, but it's R-rated. And I was like, okay, it sounds intense as crap, actually. Like, Did the, uh, the original TMNTs were... They it's, brutal? Yeah, they were brutal. That's all. Like, I haven't, I haven't read too much of them, but I know that they were, you know, they get grabbed up by people that are like, oh, kids will love this. And it's like, yeah, but, like, you know, these were made for adults originally. <laughs> right, yeah. No, I was just listening to him explain the story. I was just like, this is wild. They did not expect that. Like, <laughs> uh, it's getting pretty dark out, guys. I think we'll probably just, you know, we're going to re relocate some things, rearrange some things, and we'll probably set out when there's more daylight. Unless you want to go out at night. I really don't mind going out at night. I feel like the only real danger is at night is spiders roaming, but from what we've seen so far, man, I don't know that it matters. Like, spiders will roam anyway. Really, spiders. 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 Spooters. It's, I think it's early enough. We, we could just go ahead and go out. Okay. Let's do it. I'll follow you. Oh, um, yeah, I, so... But, while I was up here, he spotted that Jacko lantern. Yeah. Um, I then looked to my left and I was like, "What is that?" <laughs> it's just a big hedge. I don't know. I I'm just curious. I I don't know. This, you know, this huge. Uh, it's not. A, it's not. A, I mean, it's kind of is a structure, but it's not. So I just want to go take well... a look at it. Use your uh, use your peepers and slowly look from right to left. Tell me if you spot anything interesting, because there's definitely some intrigue. There's some I see some trash up in the shrubs, which you know, trash seems. I don't know. It's just yeah. And in this game, it's it's a little bit more interesting than just trash. Um, true. Something that looks like a like a base almost. I don't. That looks like a a radar satellite. Dish. Yeah. Yeah. And then, dude, the water. The water, uh, the sprinkler and the little water fountain, like, all yeah, really just, um, there's so many cool landmarks in this game. Yeah, I'm just curious about it. Let's, so let's, uh, let's go over there. Man. All right, you just want to shoot straight across, go, uh, just head toward the, uh, why am I drawing a blank? You, you literally just, just called, you, we just saw a different one. The, I don't know why I want to say spatula. Guys, that is not a spatula. That is a, uh, Oh, trowel. Trowel! Yeah. <laughs> Words. It's like, Timely just said that two minutes ago. We were running home, and he was like, oh, look at this trowel. Sometimes my brain farts really hard. Well, look at this moss. Where you at? You I at? just, like, it's, it's, this is, I, I feel like this is, uh. Oh, there you are. Oh, yeah, this is, it's like, it's not quite great. Yeah, it's got to be moss. I mean, this isn't. You know, grass is all that stuff standing up around us. This is just 
just mossy, wet nastiness. What it would feel like to just lay in some moss would be cool. Oh yeah. What are y'all doing? Oh, you're chirping. Chirp. The weird bug birds. Huh. Oh, this looks cool. Looks. Oh, I think I see. There's a science facility over there, or a science. Uh... What? That there is. Ooh, it's. Yeah, okay, it would get dark. That makes sense. It does. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's going to get dark out anyway, but I feel like under here it's always a little... A little... A little uh, shaded. We've discovered the hedge ascent. <laughs> it's... What does... Oh, man. Oh, there's some raw science up there. Huh. No, it's kind of crazy that you spotted this already and we already came, like, just came right across and you saw, I swear, I, uh, originally, I saw the, um, the fountain, the little, the little water fountain over there, or the water bath table or whatever, and, uh, I started down there, and it took me forever to come down this way and find that ascent my first playthrough, it's kind of crazy that you just stumbled upon it. Because I promise, crazy. I, I'm not leading timely around anywhere, guys. I'm just following. Uh, no, no hints are exchanged off camera. <laughs> that would be no fun. Yeah, I just, I don't know. What? Also, what kind of a? I don't know. Power cord. Some bees in here. Are oh, those like the bees have already peeped? Yeah. Okay. Oh, there's the science facility. Science facility. What is this called? Field station. Stations, okay. Yeah. Oh, there's a nice, uh, some granola bars if you want any. Oh, go for it. I have so many food things saved up on, on me already. Actually, I should probably eat a few guys. My health is a little low for some reason. What hurt me? Um, well, there's a tape right here called Kaiju Children. <laughs> what? Can you hear that as well? I don't hear it. I've got the voices all turned down, but I am reading it, and I'll stay okay. still so everybody else at home can read it real quick. I thought hiding these lab units in the hedge would provide a bit of... Oh, I'm not reading it fast enough. Flingman disc. Uh, somebody throwing... Subsequent breaches of the lab structures help invited all manner of arachnid invade. Oh, no. That's, that's a little foreboding. Unlock the mysteries of raw science. Raw science! Yep. That's funny. This sounds like somebody was throwing a frisbee a little too hard. Dang. Oh, yeah. Do berry Edge chunks. Lord. Berry chunks are awesome. Fun new resource. Seeing some raw science up behind you to your left there. Uh -huh. That's all in new places, I swear. Like, I used to know where a couple of, like, raw sciences just hung out, Ooh. but... Oh, he's a little close, isn't he? Yeah, he got real close. Luckily, bumblebees are pretty chill. Yeah, I think they're labeled as neutral. Which is like, what, they won't bother you if you don't bother them? Sounds about... Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's, a, that's a hermit lifestyle. That's a... We, we neutral oh, around here. Science. Science. What does it even mean? I don't know if you've seen it, but like all these berries too are just like hanging out. I don't know if you can see this one in front of me. Uh, I cannot see. Oh, I need a torch. I feel I, I need to craft one. Yeah. Oh, nice. You can just shoot them down. Yep. That's cool. Yeah, let's collect a couple of berries. Let's do it. I spotted something. Um, I've been wondering for a while how to how to craft, um, or something that required, like, berry flesh, and I'm wondering if this is going to be related to that, I don't know. Mm -hmm. Can you go down this way? Uh, maybe? I'll let you lead the way. Wah. Yeah, we'll have to get you oh, some oh, more oh. sap and make another torch. Yeah, that didn't hurt. Oh, nice. Berry right on the ground right here. What is that? Oh, whoop. Is that a cassette tape? It is a cassette tape. What does it say? It says, Mama Sad Fingers? Is Am I reading that right? 
no, Mama said fight the power. What? Oh, nice. <laughs> uh, that's funny. I think that's what it says. Yeah, where you want to go? Just want to deeper into the hedge and look for more berries, or? Oh yeah, yeah. Okay, I, I just saw that. Uh. Oh, the cassette. Yeah. Was that? Uh, let's head in that direction, or. Where's this cord going to? Either way, my torch has about half life left to it. Let me see if I can make another one real quick before we get too into this. Oh, what is it? What is it? Oh, it's a larva. Oof. We're on it. Uh oh, uh, actually, torch should pull the torch back out. It's super dark. Oh my gosh. Okay. Oh. Well, Shoo. guess I need to. Let I'll, me, uh... I'll stick to my one-handed weapons. Let me see if I can craft another one of these. I cannot right now. Okay. Uh, I. Are we gonna go back to the base and get to where I can also craft a torch, or we can go to sleep? Yeah, probably both. Uh, uh well, yeah. you know, our sleeping schedules get so thrown off. I, I kind of like nighttime to get prepared, guys. Let, let's, yeah, let's do that. Let's go back. Let's craft some torches for both of us, cause it's super dark in there compared to out here. Um, mm -hmm. torches would be nice. Yeah, let's do it. I'll, I'll need to remake some of the food, too. I think a lot of my food's about to go bad anyway, so... Let's do it. All my things spoiled. No! That's alright. What you gonna do? What you gonna do? Oh, there's a sort button now. That's nice. When did that happen? Thanks, guys. Oh, actually, yeah. All right. I think I'm good on every. Just gotta get a little bit of water for the morning, and we can set out. The food is a little scarce too. I might kill a few aphids or gnats just to have that as we explore too. Nice shot. <laughs> oh my gosh, is that more aphid honey? I'm gonna get sick off of this candy. <laughs> 14 aphid honey, dude. That's a record. I don't think I've ever had that much on me. Fantastic. Ah, food. Food good. We're ready to go. Let's do it. Let's get back over there. To the hedge. The hedge is a cool place. I love how, like, I don't know, it's it's such a, like, you think about it, and this is just a tiny little backyard. There's really not a whole lot going on here, but, like, man, the biomes are really just cleverly done. It's so fun. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Splash! Swim around in the nasty water. Gross. Please, water, please. They'll gang so up on weird. you. I am. I get easy, I get easily intimidated by water. It's just it's like a strange world that feels so vulnerable inside of it. Yeah. Especially in this dirty water, it's like hard. You can I can kind of see through it like when it's close to me like this, but if it gets even just a little bit away, it's like it's it's kind of foggy in there. Uh, nice. I need to boil it. I always get nervous about drop and drop what's that close to water is. I feel like they'll just mesh with the nearby water. But oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> you drop that one right on your face, though. It's perfect. Right on my face. Okay. Oh, this is much better. Still kind of, you know, it gets darker, but this is... Huh. All right. So this corner does seem like a little bit of a dead end. I'm liking that... that uh, milk molar up on top of the the power switch though. We'll have to come back for that eventually Yeah, yeah. Other than that though, I think this mm. is kind of a dead end. Nothing was behind the mixtape We've seen the bomb deer mm. beetles the larva and it looks like there's a ladybug out there, but Let's uh Follow see where this cord goes, okay mm. Uh, Looks like it goes up 
Oh, the platforming. Clip, clip. Alright, follow the cord, he says. Follow the cord! Where are you going, cord? I'm just gonna go ahead and put this out. I've got so many torches. Juice box! Apricop! Apricop! Hey! It's the, the TV show that we were seeing in the beginning. Uh -huh. Down it goes. Made spiderling? Where? Oh, I see them crawling all over the trees. What yeah. the heck? They're itty bitty though. They're oh. not like the little ones we're. Oh, hi, little buddy. Hiya! Oh, they're still pretty tough. Hiya! All right, so they're not like the Orb Weaver Juniors, which is good. <sighs> Where'd he go? Oh, he's coming at you. I can't believe I'm doing that little with this big club. Whew. Right. Yeah, yeah. Uh, on, data. Let's look at these little things here. Yeah, let's see where, where you see them. Uh, spider room. Resistance to stabbing. Got it. Okay. Good, I can use my club. There's the wire. Oh, look at that. Contraption. What's that? Uh, and juice. Need some liquid? Liquid. Zip line. Oh, man. I'm here for it. <laughs> Go for it. Right behind you. Oh, guys, can we drop? Oh, I can! Oh, cool! Uh, I just saw some raw science and I dropped about halfway and we got it! Whoa, 500! Nice, 500. Oh, yeah, dude, come here. Look at this. Oh, yeah. Got a little, uh, one of the ominents. Oh. Ooh. Are you Sorry. good? <laughs> yes, I thought it was gonna fall off. Do you have a dandelion? Are you good to float down if you do? Actually. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, okay. I got it. Okay. I was going to say, you brave. Whoa! What the heck? Oh, rusty. <laughs> I like the rusty robots. Oh. No, this is what Wendell was saying, though. He had to reprogram some of these to defend the place because of the, you know, the spiders we're getting in the spider leagues, I guess. Oh, man, these are tough. Uh, eat, eat the food. Uh. Eat the food. Okay. One more time! Oh, stamina. Come back to me, stamina. Kill it, kill it. Okay. Oh, I gotta sit down after that. Jeez, please. Okay, that was rough. Probably should have brought more, uh, uh, more healing stuff. Man, these chests are pretty cool. I feel like these were brand new. Uh, I feel like they were never part of the game until very, very recently, which is really cool. I like the just random, yeah. random draw. Everybody loves to find a chest. I mean, who doesn't love to find chests? Right. Oh, we got another, huh. got another folder over here, labeled uh, oh. reboot. Virgil transcription order seventy three. <laughs> the Mach 3s were never good. <laughs> uh, that's funny. Oh yeah, he does. He has a spatula attached to him. So like, I'm pretty sure Burgle used to be like literally like a short order cook. Was his original purpose. <laughs> I will never forget this moment. Guys, would you like me to read those out? Like, I would have a ton of fun actually reading those out. Like, that could be really fun. For, uh, if you'd like, you know, everybody's listening anyway. Would you like me to read them out? Leave me a link, or not a link. <laughs> Leave me a comment uh, down below. And uh, yeah, if that's something you want to. Hey, look what we found. 
It's the, uh, it's the, 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 the thing we were looking at. Yeah, yeah, I was wondering about this. Big ol', um, the windows, some raw sources of signs. Wow, look at the yard. We can see all the way to our house from here. Stuff. Whoa. Ugh. Crazy. Absolutely crazy. Huh. What do we have back here? Increase reach, ratio, recommendation. Success rate. Re reboot. Having to reboot all the time. You got any uh, do you have bandages on you? I don't actually. Uh, I'll take one, you take one. Sounds good. Oh, look at this. Yep. <laughs> Pull? Question mark? <laughs> Should there we, we do go. the thing? Look at that. Look at that. Oh, okay. So this changes the game pretty cool, actually. I love this. This is a, this is a great detail. Ah, yeah. That little thing is operational now. Oh, yeah. We'll have to check it up. Or check it out at the end of the episode for sure. All right. Well, that was an awesome find. I love the scanner. The scanner is really fun. We'll have to mess with that when we get out of here. Shall we keep going? Yeah. I know, doesn't it make you want to check everything? You're like, what else is around? What else is interactable around here? Right, uh, yeah. Grounded's good for huh. that. It's just like, you can miss stuff really easy. Like, uh, you know, how many people found this place and didn't flip the switch? Be honest now. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we were heading... Right, we came from right to left with the zip line, so... Can we, you got over here pretty easy. Was there an easy path? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Nice, okay. That's right here. Let's keep going. Hmm. It's getting a little darker, but that's okay. I don't mind the dark in here, like like, like we were saying earlier. It's just oh, always a little up. dark. Oh, spiderling! Hiya! Nice. We just getting web for killing these guys? Yeah, just web. So. Hey, that's okay. Oh, what? I don't like that. I know a spider, uh, spider eggs when I see them. Oh yeah. Whoa. What was that noise? Did you hear oh, that? It's the, it's the bird. Oh. Whoa. Do you see the light coming up from underneath the bird? Is that, that must be sunlight getting through somewhere or something. Crazy looking. Hmm. There's another zip line over here, though. Oh, yeah. Over there. How do we get over uh, there? I can kind of see something that looks like a path, but it looks risky. Yeah. I'm just going to try and ignore those spider eggs. I might. I might be inclined to bail out if <laughs> those things hatch. <laughs> <laughs> Getting the... Oh, there's a... Huh. Hey, another zip line. Yeah. You were just... We just come from... That zip line actually no. isn't attached to anything. I wonder if did we, we just come from that? Over there? No. No, we did not. That one's actually got power and everything in it. Let's uh, let's go check that out. Let's do it. How do we walk? How do we how walk? Do we walk past. Oh, how do we walk past that? Oh, spider egg. Well, you can just. Own. Yeah, I think they're all right. I think they're kind of neutral. You can attack them. Oh, my thirsty. I'm not biggie. No, don't equip the... Uh, put that away. 
<laughs> Hang on, I'm trying to just trying to take a sip out of my canteen. Buttons are uh -huh. not cooperate. There we go. Oh. No lemon crime. There we go. Hoppity hop. Nice. Hey, another chest. What do you get out of these things? Hey, some brittle marble. <gasps> another scab bee. Bug, Bug juice. juice. What's it look like? I don't know why, but this is like one of my favorite parts of the game, finding these things. Oh, look at that, bug juice. Ah, that one's all right. I might stick with the other one. What did I have originally? What were we working with, guys? The bugged one? Because that one was pretty cool. Oh, it's another... Deep. <laughs> nice. For so long, I have felt taunted by the spiders. Climbing, crawling, skittering with the greatest of ease. Oh, how they delight in violating my workspace. <laughs> <laughs> Poor Wendell. Uh, I can't take a single step without getting stuck in their confounded webbing. I'm wasting daylight running, climbing, surviving. Man, that's why we play. <laughs> Traversing this broken lab, the entire yard for that matter, has become untenable. But perhaps my spider friends hold the key to my problems. There you go. There you go, Wendell. That's using the old noggin. Hmm. That's a... Uh... There you go. Yeah, I'm just gonna snack on that. Was that all that was? Yeah, that's pretty much all that was in. Oh, hey! Here's a water droplet on... Do you need a... You need a drink? There's a dew drop literally on the ceiling here. That's neat. Um... I will... Hey, there you go. Oh man, it's getting dark up here now. <laughs> Oof. Oh hey, nice. Game's giving you a hint. Yeah, use this. <laughs> How high can we go? All the way, it appears. Uh oh. Not over here. Ooh, yeah. Oh, here we go. That zip line is right beneath us. I know we still haven't gotten to that one uh, back toward our green flag, but. Uh, uh, There's a frisbee over there. Hey, that must be the one he was talking about. Okay. Uh, it looks like the, the beginning of the zip line is actually right beneath us. If we can do a safe. Oh, we don't even have to fall. We can just go down. And walk around. Yeah, look at that. I'm gonna chop this webbing because the way this stuff was flinging me around the other episode, I do not want to experience that all the way up here. <laughs> oh heck yeah! After you. Oh man, doing this in the dark. <laughs> oh yeah, this is creepy. Yeah, webbing, webbing bad. All right, how do we get up on the prison? The Flingman Flying Disc. <laughs> Corsar X. <laughs> no way, that's two streets down. <laughs> that's funny. <laughs> well, Pete. Behind you! Oh. Yeah. Oh, nice! Another scab bee. Oh, I love these. Hi. Yeah. Uh. Nice. Whew. Don't like it. All right. Yeah, you don't want to mess with any of the egg sacs. Uh, maybe one. <laughs> I don't know. It's... Oh man, what's gonna happen? Spider yeah. legs! <laughs> oh, come back here. Where'd he 
go. Ow. Ah, little nuisance. They're like mites, but they hit harder. <laughs> Look at all that webbing. So that didn't seem to happen, but I'm pretty sure that if you crack open spider sacks like this, like, you, you generally do have to fight some spiderlings, but I swear there's, like, an odd chance for them to just drop random bug parts, too. But, maybe not anymore. I didn't see it happen that time. Gotta get that raw science. Whoa. Yeah, I... <laughs> Oh man. Yeah, no. Is this yeah, a no, whole no, cavern? No, no, I don't know. <laughs> Should we take a peek? I don't know. Oh man. Get ready to run. Oh my gosh. Oh, oh man, hold on. I'm gonna. Is there a way to hide the. the UI? Uh, um. Hold on. If there is, please let me know. <laughs> hey. I don't think there is. I've tried for thumbnails, but I just don't, I don't know that there is. Oh my gosh. I don't know, man. This is one of those things, you know in horror movies, and you're just like, no, no, don't go, don't. You know, like, and now, now I'm like, oh, maybe I'm just as dumb as those people. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, let's get out of here. I don't know about that. Ooh. Uh, Larva are still too tough. I, I don't want to fight a... Or, like, I don't know. We don't need to be taking big spiders on toe-to-toe -to -toe right yet, I don't think. Whew. Dude, spiderlings are annoying. I don't... Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. Uh, it does look like we can continue this way, and I'm seeing more raw... Si no, that's not raw science. That's another zip line. Zip line. Go always take some more spider sex. What, what, you like, attack more? Eh, we don't have to. I'm all, I'm just all a little cocky, because I'm, I'm so used to playing this on the easiest difficulty. <laughs> it's a plan. And away he goes. Oh man, that might get me killed, but that would be fun. Where there's oh. a spider. Oh, there's a bunch of spiderlings over here. We can do it! Yeah! Yeah! Hey, any more? We good? Stop swinging. Okay. <laughs> Whew. Okay. Oh, looks like we got a family portrait over here. Hey, it's Wendell. And I'm not gonna lie, hmm. neither of those kids look like us. <laughs> yeah. The uh the daughter looks like the mad magazine kid. <laughs> Hang on, I gotta look at this again. Nope. Yeah, a little bit. Oh you got some nachos. Nachos. That's awesome. There's a tape here, I'm gonna Go bring it. it up. Today, Trudy asked, or rather insisted, I take a break from work for a family day. Well, yeah. I'll admit the argument that preceded my reluctant agreement was one for the ages. Wendell, always spend time with your family. She doesn't understand how important the work is. Doesn't matter! But in the end, not all was lost. As fate would have it, our little trip to Stormin' Beach's Wave Park gave me a fresh inspiration. Your attraction sported a zip line. Oh, is that where he got the idea for all these zip lines? Oh, goodness. Basking the light of the cruel sun that baked them like red, red raisins. But I digress. It was the zip line that captured my imagination. Such an elegant solution to my problems in the hedge. When we got home, it was straight back to work. After another argument, of course. Wendell! <laughs> Not doing good, man. Oh. Dude, check this out. I was just putting the text like out here in the dark so it was a little easier for everybody to read, but look beneath us. Ooh. 
It's almost like this was connected. Yeah, that's all it was. It seems like it was, and then it just fell apart. Yeah, or the Frisbee knocked it down. I know he was complaining about oh, the Frisbee yeah. earlier. Well, there's another piece out that way. Whoa, ow, where? Oh, they're so small. They don't make as much noise as, as mites either. They just wait till they're right on top of you. Sneaky little jerks. Yeah, a little bit of a dead end. There was a yeah, there's another branch back this way to our right, I think. Ooh. This is quite intimidating in the dark. Yeah. Oh, for sure. Ah, this kind of brings me back to the Divine Tower of, of Kaled. <laughs> oh, look at this. Guys, let's go above. Oh! Is there a... Oh! Is it, was that a dead end? Yeah. I got I got, the, I got the path then. Okay, I got all excited like I found something secret, but this must be the way we go. It's, it's a tricky little path. Watch the webbing. We're good. All is well. Ooh. You know what's funny is I really don't mind heights in real life. <laughs> For some reason, I care about my characters a little too much. <laughs> I mind them in both. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so there's a zipline over there, but there's a raw science up there. Yeah, I want to get that raw science. Totally going for it. Go for it. No, I don't think both of us need to risk it. Hi! Oh, there we go. That a boy, Max. We can do this. Ah, okay. So close. No! We're okay. Oh, man. Am I going to be able to get back up? Oh, where am I? Okay. Okay. Hi. Nice. Okay, let's try that one more time. Maybe even from start from here would be a little safer. There we go. Go. No! Oh, oh! Jumping is bad. I'm hitting my head on something. What am I? Oh, uh, oh! Uh, okay. Can be another leaf. Yeah, probably. Uh, oh! No! 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 Oh! Oh, this is bad. Oh, Max! Uh. Max! Oh, Max! <laughs> oh no! Okay. Okay. Well, this is a shame. I don't think I can get back up to you from here. Oh. Okay. If I can, it'll be a miracle. What? Can I do? Oop. <sighs> oh, am I just on the ground again? I am. Okay. Well, that stinks. I'm flying. Look at him go. Oh, you found the hedge lab. Nice. Nat natural explorer. Heck yeah. Um, wait. I kind of feel bad now. How am I going to get back up there to you? Crud. Raw. Some raw sounds. Um, it's funny, you're only 50 centimeters away. I can see you. <laughs> oh. We've got orb weavers down here sleeping. Oh, look at this, guys. It's like spiraling down. Can I get in? Hang you on. You might be able to just get in. Hang on. Oh, the door's locked. Oh, no. I got to let you in. Timely. <laughs> oh, that's so funny. Ugh. All right. Well, I'll keep climbing around the outside, I guess. Oh, man. I'm so bummed. I'll try not, I'll try not to explore too much up here. Guys, let's see if we can do it, because I'd rather not have to climb back through the entire thing again. Ah! Ah! I'm, ah! Might have to use the biometric scanner to open these doors. Hold on. There's that. Hand on the scan. Hand on the scanner. Oh, oh, falling again. Okay, okay, we're okay. All is, oh. What is that sound? Power grid control. Mash keys. <laughs> hey, actually, I think they did it. I think the door is green. Hang on. Ah. I 
think I literally just saw the door that I was trying to get into light up. <gasps> no way! Look at us! Dude, you are awesome. Alright, let's find our way to each other. Okay, okay, new plan, new plan. Can you make your way back to- I don't think I can get to you without going through a bunch of stuff, too. Can you get back to, uh, your zip line where you entered? Yes. Dude, see if you can drop down- like, I hate to pull you to me, but, like, if you want to, I think we could both enter from here and start exploring together. I think it'd be kind of hard for me to get to you, actually. If you can see me Hold down on. here. Ow! Oh, do I not have a dandy- oh, nope, my dandelion choked. Uh, where is that thing? Okay. There you are. Yeah, just float right toward me. Sweet. There is an orb weaver, like, right beneath us. Awesome! Dude, yeah. <laughs> Sorry to- dude, uh, yeah, we did not grab that- that little 500 <laughs> piece of- I'm assuming- oh, it's fine. It better be 500 for that kind of jump. Uh, <laughs> right. oh my gosh. Ooh! Oh, well, all right, guys. I guess I'm going to go ahead and let the episode wrap up right there. So much fun exploring the Hedge Lab, uh, turning on the uh, the scanner. The, uh, that's that's so much fun. And I am so excited to get into this Hedge Lab with you because these are, like, dungeons. Like, this is going to be fun. Oh, oh man. Thank you. Yeah, I'm super excited. But, guys, yeah, if you're excited to join us on the next adventure and explore the Hedge Lab, be sure to subscribe, stick around, and, uh, yeah, so this is gonna be this is gonna be too much fun. This whole this whole episode was a lot of fun, a lot of fun. The hedge is just just full of really entertaining stuff. Yeah, yeah. No, I I, I uh, had an inkling that it was gonna be that it was gonna have a lot of depth. There was there was something about it that would uh screamed like, hey, like what's what's in here? Yeah, no, it it does. It has a lot of layers to it. It's so much fun. Uh, but anyway, everybody, I hope you're having a great day. Have a great rest of your day. And we'll see you in the next episode.